So Creo Simulation Live is a whole new product that does not exist today. So what we have taken is a groundbreaking simulation technology that is real time and embedded it natively in the parametric CAD model so that all the design decisions you make, you can get insight into what the engineering consequences are of those design changes in real time, very easy to use. Customers will be a lot more apt to do simulation as part of the design process because it'll be uh, seamlessly available in the design process so it'll help them shrink. When they finally get to the end of the process, they'll have a higher quality product that much, much more likely to meet their requirements. So that's, I mean, that's what we're all about. It changes everything. It's one of these profound things that when technology becomes easy to use and fast to use, all of a sudden behavior changes. So, you know, I was an early adopter of the internet. Back in the day, it took 15 minutes to dial up on modems, right? It was super slow. My wife thought I was crazy spending that much time because she could just like call the bank and get our bank statement faster than I could. Fast forward to today when we have an always on device in our back pocket. So when technology becomes intuitive, when it becomes real time, our behavior changes. And I think this is what uh, the PTC Creo Live will do for engineering. It will change the way we do engineering. Before you demo it, no one believes that it is that easy and that fast. <laughs> so that's, you know, that's where, we, where we have to start, right? It's like changing the viewing mode of your model from shaded to shaded with edges. It's as simple as that. You just make sure the simulation is on, make a design change and see the consequences. And then I think people do underestimate this behavior change that I talked about. Um, and I've seen this. We are historically afraid to do too much experimentation because it's costly. It was costly in the old world in terms of simulating because it took weeks to set it up so you'd be very careful about what you simulate. Or a physical prototype can be costly, right? Cost you thousands of dollars or millions of dollars and months to build a physical prototype. So we're very careful, right? We actually have to abandon that carefulness and do crazy things. Um, I think it, it, it was, uh, you know, penicillin was discovered by going through tens of thousands of different compounds until you found the, the one that actually reacted antibiotically. Um, so do that experimentation. Go through tens of thousands of different iterations. That's what we need to do, sort of mindset change.